I know so many people from the college program who got this exact job. Yeah, I just wanted to do like a mini update video, but also like get ready with me for work. So I got a job working as a Hi everyone, I'm having a moment right now because I'm about to film a video about my new job when I was sitting here like back in March when I lost my job and I was sitting in this exact spot. It's a little weird, but anyway, I have a job now and I wanted to do like a get ready with me for my first day, I guess, or just to talk about it. Today is my very first day. It is July 25th. My last day of work was March 15th. So it's one, two, 19 weeks ago? Is that even right? Oh my gosh, the lighting is so bad. My cheekbones, ew. What? It's like I have these big cheeks and they're like, these cheekbones that I don't, you see that? I look like Voldemort or something. <laughs> anyway, um, 19 weeks ago. That's a really long time. I know that a lot of us are in that same exact position. I'm not saying that like, I'm special or anything. Anyway, before we talk about that, look at this mug I got for my birthday. It's called Ember. Not sponsored, but I wish that it was. Everyone always says that, don't they? Not sponsored, but I wish it was. But it just keeps your drink warm. If you're like me, I always make it and then I just forget about it. But this coffee and it'll keep it warm for like two hours with the app. It's great. I just wanted to do some eye makeup because I don't know the last time that I did. I put my hair up. So how I found this job was, well, every day I would look on Indeed every day for hours in a day. Oh my gosh, I just realized this is what I'm using. Okay, this is the only palette I have. And I don't wanna talk about it. <laughs> so this is what I'm using. So I got a job working as a temperature screener at Disney. Uh, it's not for Disney, so it's like a third party company. It's as close as I can get, shall we say. It is at Disney. Um, just the people who take your temperature before you go into the park or into Disney Springs. So today I'll be at Disney Springs and tomorrow as well. I know lots of people are like, oh, you shouldn't be going to work or you shouldn't be doing this right now and this, but like, we have to live. <laughs> People need jobs and people have to go to work and it's really sad and it's not fair but it's just like how it is unfortunately. Please just be nice, uh, think before you comment anything. But I'm honestly excited, I've just been at home for so, so long. The only thing I'm worried about is Nobby because where is she? I don't know where she went, but do you see that hair flip? <laughs> I, I got her during quarantine, like right when quarantine started, like a week after it started. So she's just been here with me for weeks months i am afraid like because she's in a routine so i'm just afraid that she's gonna like be upset or something i don't know i've never had a cat of my own per se we've had like family cats but i've never had my own cat but i hope that she'll be okay she's just a little baby yeah i just wanted to do like a mini update video but also like get ready with me for work so yeah today and tomorrow i'll be at disney springs and then next week i'll be at epcot and Magic Kingdom. And I was going to do my hair, but I know it's gonna get really hot outside, so I think I'm just gonna put it up in a ponytail. And they gave us little hats to wear too, so that's cute. Now that I've started the camera, I don't really know what to say. It's just like, yeah, I have a job now. I almost did a clickbait title, and I was gonna say, oh, I got a job at Disney because it is at Disney, but it's not for Disney. But I didn't want to do that to anybody <laughs> because when I do get a job at Disney, I won't be able to do that again. But yeah, this job is perfect. I know so many people from the college program who got this exact job. It's great because it's temporary, and who knows how long that they're gonna need these people. Me. <laughs> um, they said until at least December, but I'm hoping to be back with Disney by then. I don't know, but it doesn't come with any Disney perks or anything in case you were wondering, cause I was. Oh my gosh, I just realized it's Saturday night, so it's gonna be quite busy. When we went last Friday, it was quite busy. But I saw that Universal just canceled Horror Nights and Disney canceled their uh, Halloween party, which I think they are right in doing that because like most of it is like parades and shows and fireworks and if they're not doing any of that then it's like why would you want to buy a ticket to go you know Halloween Horror Nights also makes sense because like I haven't been so I don't really know but I can imagine like in the haunted houses people are like all huddled up even like because I've been to haunted houses and even people you don't know you're just like hiding behind them we were gonna go this year but it's not a big deal like we'll just go next year I'm gonna finish my makeup take her to work and I will see you then
okay <laughs> i just got back from taking curtis to work and now i'm going to get dinner ready so that when we get home we can just eat <laughs> and oh also get my bag my bag ready it's only like a six hour shift but i gotta bring a bag <laughs> i think i'm going to bring this that curtis got me i use it for like two years of school and I've never gotten to use it since <laughs> so I think I'm gonna bring this and just bring like a snack and water I don't think that I really get a break today since it's only like six hours or maybe less so maybe they'll just be like a 15 minute break or something but yeah I'm excited to go but I'm really worried about Navi because I don't want to leave her by herself she's really used to us being here at night there she is she looks really scared right now are you spooked ignore the mess that is under my bed but don't all of our bed look like this okay i'm on the third harry potter book and i would bring it but like i said i don't really think i'm gonna get a break today but i know next week i have longest shifts like seven or eight hours so i'm definitely going to bring my book for that i got this really cute water bottle from target it was like ten dollars or something but it's cute i feel like it would be double at the parks so Target, and they had all the different houses. All right, so I'm currently packing my backpack, which they said that the cubby, cubbies, lockers, whatever, they said like that they're kind of small, but I don't know if, <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna work, but um, may as well try it. I don't know. I feel like people bring like lunches and stuff. I mean, I don't wanna bring this bag because it's quite nice as I'm like, but I'm going to bring sunglasses what else do i have oh my mints i need those at all times my purse i have this cute new universal mask i got yesterday it's like their retro theme or 90s theme whatever they brought back which is a really cool collection chapstick i can't go anywhere without chapstick um uh, i think that's oh i'm sorry my hand sanitizer this one is stress relief because <laughs> oh and i have my badge that they gave me if you can see it very nice very nice i saw this tweet that was like um bath and body works is like 10 percent alcohol and then 90 percent glitter <laughs> but it says on the back 68 percent alcohol so i my mask i think they're gonna obviously give us masks because this is a little controversial universals at disney <laughs> but it's so cute like the colors are so vibrant i love it i'm gonna bring that and i'm gonna bring a snack um, probably just some goldfish. I'm just blabbing on, but I'm gonna get ready. I like to get there early, especially on the first day when I don't really know where I'm going. Like they said to me in like the break room of this one place, and I don't know where that is. But it should be fun to uh, try and find it along with everyone else. So I will check in either tomorrow morning or at the end of the shift if I remember to, and tell you how everything went. Oh yeah, I'll see you later. <laughs> so it's a few days later and I've already worked three shifts. So I was at Disney Springs and Magic Kingdom. There isn't really much to talk about. I guess it was fun. Uh, Disney Springs is a little bit harder because it's like a 50-50 shot if someone's gonna be nice to you because I feel like they don't know the rules or they don't wanna follow the rules or they think the rules are stupid. Uh, so that is kind of difficult, but a Magic Kingdom, everybody was so nice. They knew the rules. They knew they had to do that to get in. Um, so I definitely loved working in Magic Kingdom, although it was a, a lot warmer at the park. At Disney Springs, we're at the parking garage, so we are out of the sun all day until it starts to go down a bit, and then it like kind of creeps through. But you can just like keep moving forward, and you won't be in the sun. But as for Magic Kingdom... You're in a tent, so it's a little bit warmer, I would say. Um, but it usually rains every day. I mean, it's about to rain right now, and it's nearly 4 o'clock. So it always rains around this time every day now. And that is really helpful because it will cool it down here. The rest of my shifts for this week are at Epcot. So we will see how that goes. I've heard that it's really hot there too, but I'm kind of used to it. Obviously, after living here for almost my whole life, um you do kind of get used to the sun it's a bit worse with the uh, mask of course but again you do get used to that as well as long as you just keep drinking water and they're really nice about giving breaks like if you need 10 minutes just to sit down and have a drink you can do that there's always someone 
uh, to cover you while you want to do that go to the bathroom have a snack and all that stuff So yeah, I have no complaints I'm just happy to be able to work and have a job I think that's about everything But if you have any questions about the job, I don't know if they're still hiring But if you're interested, uh, just message me on Instagram and we can chat about it But anyway, <laughs> thanks for watching this video and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!